What's your guess is we're going to get this down to without destroying it first? Well, I can what we might get it down to like 105, maybe. Maybe, maybe get down to 100 or so. We need one in there, I reckon. Don't want the always overdo that. I won't put the cables back in yet. Well, that's going to be an interesting problem. So, the first issue we got is this bit on the battery holder is needed for the scroll wheel. So, you're not going to get that taken out unless you cut it because the scroll wheel locks in place using this pillar. The tank of a battery back in. This thing's like, what's the point in that? A little bit of a cable tie. Why? These switches are mint. So all uh, up to mech one should have this mechanism. You can just interchange them like that. It's so easy. So here's your first issue. If you take out the diffuser, you can have a nice gap rocking around the bottom. So here's the bit gimped but scroll wheel slightly off for some reason but we're just doing as a mock-up this is what you can get if you don't destroy it you are gonna have this gap though let's go on let's just put let's leave the diffuser in rear panel on for now still 102 grams totally won't get it below it I said, you take the rear panel off, you can. 97 grams, you take the rear panel off. <laughs> so that's the basic stuff on the left that's not going in here. Straight off the bat. We shouldn't leave us that many parts, look. Took all the crap out of it. So let's ping off this thing because this thing is annoying me straight off the bat. Feels quite thin, like the plastic's quite thin. It's even plastic riveted that one. Uh, 0.5 a gram. What are these magnets for? Why do I want these ones? Ah, it's for the docking station. Right, okay. I'm trying to remind myself. Still attach it to your station if you wanted. Right, that's it for now. Trim a bit more up. Put it way out actually.
Right, we have to keep this part, so. Let's move it up this bit. You cannot use your scroll wheel. Could be an issue. in a sec. Alright. Look all the 502s, a little bit tricky this one. Try and cut inside here, not easy to see. side drill out. Razor's definitely thin the base on this one, it is a thin base for sure. I'm sure we can get as much out of this as we expect on the uh, base on this because it's pretty thin. We've got quite a bit out the back though, I guess. This is my favourite uh, design at the minute. together. Yeah, 
There you go, 90. It's more like it. Just 92 with the diffuser. So 150 and uh, 200 battery. Difference in the battery. So stock battery, like 12 grams. Uh, 200. So already 8 grams off ish. Did you put the 200 milliamp in it? Let's go, let's go 200 milliamp then. Battery's now done, so it weighs now. Was it like 4.4? So let's mock it back up again. So I remember the rear plate. Eighty-three. Take the rear plate off it. 78, not bad. 83 is not bad, it's about the same, 86. 82, something like that, oops. Yeah, it's okay. 85. There you go. You can that. Good turn on. Bit of a dazzler there. Gap at the bottom, but once you glue it, it'll be right. 